Uh, TX is a very important program to the United States Air Force. Of course, they have to replace the T-38. About a 46-year-old airplane, average life of the T-38. So the U.S. Air Force, uh, as our customer, is very focused on it. Uh, TX is a family of systems. It is replacing the airplane for the T-38, but also the ground-based training and the entire training architecture for, for TX. So the Air Force has been looking at this for a number of years. They've done an analysis of alternatives. They've done several RFIs, requests for information. We industry and BA Systems have responded to that. We're very excited in supporting the U.S. Air Force. Uh, we're very uh, close to them and have done a number of things with the U.S. Air Force in the United States. And of course, we have a combined team. BA Systems is leading this in the U.S. with our team here in the U.K and uh, partners uh, two that we have on this are Northrop Grumman, Rolls-Royce, and L3 Link in the United States. Well, the U.S. Air Force has worked uh, to try to fund this program. Of course, we've had, they've had some budget challenges over the last few years, but it's obvious now this 15 budget that they're very interested in moving out on TX, uh, important, very important program in the United States Air Force. There is funding and uh, it's obvious talking to our U.S. Air Force customers that they're excited about this and starting off on the path to ultimately procure this system. I think there are many common things about TX for the Air Force and advanced pilot training around the world. They need a, a trainer, they need a system and a family of systems. What's unique about the U.S. Air Force is it's a huge Air Force, the largest Air Force in the world. Uh, it's a big procurement, a number of airplanes to replace the T-38, a number of ground-based simulators. So it's a very large program and critical to training pilots for the United States Air Force to enter into the combat Air Force. Uh, everything we do uh, in our militaries are around training and training the best, in the Air, Air Force's case, the best pilots. So TX is a very big deal to the Air Education Training Command. The key elements again on TX are a airplane, a trainer, uh, a very capable trainer. Uh, today in the art of training pilots, we do sensor simulation. Our Hawk trainer is um, uh, very much organized around a cockpit simulation effort that uh, has a radar simulation, electronic warfare simulation, weapon simulation in the cockpit. We do this today for the Royal Air Force uh, in the UK with the T2 Hawk and uh, that will be the baseline for what we're going to do for the US Air Force. So this sensor sim around the airplane is very, very key to do affordable training. And then of course, what's also key to it is the whole family of systems architecture, which is the ground-based training piece uh, and the other elements of how to connect the simulators and the training elements into the airplane. Much of training today in Air Forces and certainly for TX will be in the ground-based piece. We're almost getting to the point where it's 50-50. 50 percent in the simulator, 50 percent in the airplane for training. UK and the RAF is very close to that right now out at RAF Valley for the Hawk. So BA Systems has been doing advanced pilot training for decades. Uh, we of course have built many many airplanes and variants of the Hawk. We have a brand new airplane that the RAF is flying and we're very excited about potentially offering this up uh, to the United States Air Force. Well, this conference is, uh, of course, a great place to network, uh, talk to our customers, and many of them are here that fly the Hawk around the world. Uh, the Canadians are here, the Australians are here, the uh, Swedes are here, for example, and, uh, of course, a U.S. Air Force customer is here. All elements of the U.S. Air Force that would be involved in a TX procurement. So it's an opportunity for us to talk to our customers and also talk to other industry uh, friends that we have here. and We know many of the industry players on advanced pilot training and of course TX. So it's really good to be able to connect with them here and talk about where TX is going.